हेलो वाइज इट्स राजेश चावड़ा फॉर केमिस्ट्री फॉर यू गाइज नाउ द बैटरीज बैटरीज आर वाट इलेक्ट्रोकेमिकल सेल टू रिप्रेजेंट टू रिप्रेजेंट अरेंजमेंट ऑफ अरेंजमेंट ऑफ टू और मोर्गेनिक सेल टू और मोर्गेनिक सेल इन सीरीज मोर गैलवेनिक सेल स्पेलिंग रिलेटेड विट गेटिंग मिस्टेक बाई फोटिंग फॉर दैट सॉरी टू रिप्रेजेंट द अरेजमेंट ट्रू और मोर गैलवेनिक सेल्स वेन दे आर कनेक्टेड इन सीरीज वेन दे आर कनेक्टेड इन सीरीज नाउ इट्स एग्जाम्पल इज वट ड्राई सेल प्राइमरी बैटरीज नंबर वन पॉइंट इज दिस नंबर टू दे बिकम डेट दे बिकम डेड ओवर ए पीरियड ऑफ टाइम बिकॉज दे कैन नॉट रिचार्ज ओवर अ पीरियड ऑफ टाइम बिकॉज दे कैन नॉट गेट रिचार्ज दे कैन नॉट गेट रिचार्ज नाउ वन इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन आई एम जस्ट गोइंग टू चैल यू देन आई मेक इट्स डायग्राम एंड वन क्वेश्चन question is that which has been asked in the exam number of times why the life of why the life of primary battery are short why the life of primary batteries are short answer is this that during working there is ammonium chloride during working during working there is a ammonium chloride acetic salt is present acetic salt is present which corrode zinc anode now see its reaction and diagram take this one box again one another box again take one big box another one big box one another box seal them make their handle also this is what graphite this is cathode this is the electrolyte mno2 ammonium chloride this is the zinc container and paste of ammonium chloride and zinc chloride 
now because of that this is electrochemical cell and in electrochemical cell at anode the oxidation takes place and zinc will lose two electron and coming in the plus two charge losing two electrons whereas at cathode reduction is going on so that reaction is taking place in this way mno2 with ammonium ion with the presence of electron it is converting into the mn 2o3 plus ammonia plus water so oxidation reduction improved mno2 is moving from plus 4 charge to plus 3 charge showing reduction you have to balance this one also 2mno2 2nh4 plus 2 electrons mno2 3 2 ammonia so this is oxidation and reduction proves and whenever primary battery this is actually called dry cell primary battery is first part it, it is dry cell second i am going to share you right now yes guy now batteries are two types primary battery dry cell which i explained you no life no longer life due to acetic salt mercury cell now there is we are taking care diagram you can draw and uh, question is that now at anode at anode the reaction is going on otherwise you will write down the reaction whenever combined reaction easy you can write down and learn that its combined reaction is zinc mercury amalgam with mercury oxide it will give you what zinc oxide plus mercury in liquid here the main thing is that he is using the paste of hgo and kh these both are bases this is base so it will not corrode and same here it is zinc anode this is a carbon cathode which we are using in the last reaction also the, its life is a little bit better than dry cell means of that mercury cells life is better than dry cell because here we are using the electrolyzer as an base now the next point is that secondary cells you never miss that class secondary cell is coming every year i'll just take 5 minutes to explain the secondary cell that is inverter present in our home and they are also known as battery thank you dear students thank you very much